What's going on my friends, it's c 3 and just wanted to give you a very quick tutorial on how to install plugins or effects into that free program called Audacity. There's not a whole lot to it. You're basically clicking and dragging the plugin and dumping it into the location where Audacity has been downloaded to on your computer. This will work for Windows, it works for Mac, it works for Linux, so you're good no matter which version of Audacity you're using. Um, I've got this plug in here, Monster Chorus, that I want to use in Audacity. So what I'm gonna do is uh, you can click and drag, you can cut, you can copy and paste. I'm just gonna right click and copy. Then I'm gonna go to, um, let's, let's go to my C drive to locate Audacity. And then I'm gonna go to Program Files x86. Then I'm gonna go find Audacity, which is right here and open up Audacity, and then there is a folder called Plugins. So you can just right click and paste the plugin into the Plugins folder. And here's how you enable that effect. So currently it's, it's dormant, it's not working, I'm not able to, like, Monster Chorus is not here yet. So what you have to do is go to the Add slash Remove Plugins at the top, you click on that, and you scroll down, it's in alphabetical order, so let's go to M. So here it says new. So this means it's one that is not enabled yet. So I will click enable, and you notice it now says enabled. Then you click OK. Then let's open up a file. Um, I've just got this little guitar track here, and let's add my new effect, Monster Chorus. So I don't know why there are two sections of effects in Audacity, but there are. So usually it's in the second section under here is where you will find that newly enabled effect. So let's click on Monster Chorus, and here it is, uh, that effect. Let's uh, just tamper with it and preview. And it sounds super lovely. Oh, before you go, just know that some plugins will not work with Audacity. They're just uh, maybe a little too complex for uh, how simple Audacity is with its effects. So if you've enabled the effect, but it still does not show up as an option to even use it, unfortunately, it just is not usable in Audacity. And that's it.